Hello and welcome to the show. Ivanka Trump and Jared Kushner are one of the US's most prominent couples, but they actually split up temporarily back in 2008, a book has revealed. Ivanka and Jared are both senior advisors to President Trump for women's issues and strategic plannings, respectively. Their appointments led to accusations of nepotism and Ivanka being dubbed the first daughter, a title she reportedly likes. However, this power couple has not always been so strong. They split for several months in 2008 after a year of dating. The breakup was partly due to Jared's parents, Charlie and Cyril Kushner, apparently being horrified by the match. According to 2019 book Kushner Inc., they were concerned that Ivanka was not Jewish and were aghast that Jared was considering marrying outside the faith. Author Vicky Ward wrote, The idea was particularly offensive to Cyril, who had raised the children. They were her world, and her world was the closed, conservative Jewish culture she had grown up in. Charlie and Cyril refused to even meet Ivanka, although Hammer repeatedly talked to Charlie about it. Alan Hammer, lawyer and friend of Charlie, reportedly told him, You're the closest people to your children of anybody that I know. So what are you going to do to Charlie? Are you going to go sit Shiva for your favorite child? Shiva is a period of seven days of formal mourning for the dead observed by Jews. Ivanka and Jared were apart for just three months before they were reunited. The cupid behind their reunion was none other than Rupert Murdoch's then wife Wendy Dung Murdoch. Jared reportedly hung out with the News Corp's boss while heading up the New York Ad Observer. After he and Ivanka split, Wendy invited them both on a boating holiday without telling them the other would be there. It was on this holiday that they rekindled their romance. Soon after, Ivanka converted to Judaism as a compromise for the family. The conversion took place under the instruction of Rabbi Haskell Luckstein, who led the congregation Kehilath Jeshurun on New York's Upper East Side. He was a member of the Rabbinical Council of America, which has great influence over determining whether a conversion is legitimate. According to friends, Charlie went along with the conversion because he felt like he had no other option but remained skeptical of Ivanka. Family friend Bob Sommer recalled that he made the conversion process as challenging as possible in order to test her devotion. Mr. Thomas told Ms. Ward that this wasn't like talk to a rabbi, read a couple of paragraphs. It was hard and it was on Charlie's terms. However, Ivanka not only passed the test, but surpassed expectations and stunned everyone involved. She charmed her in-laws and Charlie was soon waxing lyrical about how much Ivanka wanted to be a member of their family. By the time Ivanka and Jared got married in 2009, the Kushners were effusive about her. Thank you.